What's up, guys? It's Shewitt Tomlin here from Team Builder, and I'm going to show you how to program RPR into a Team Builder workout. Now, you can do this using Excel or maybe another application or software, but in this case, we're using Team Builder. And if you don't have a Team Builder account, you can start a 14-day trial. Uh, the benefit of doing that is that we have three RPR warm-ups that include videos that can be added into your account for free. Um, so if you want to do that, feel free to do so. Um, now, in order to do this, you, you most likely will want an RPR video. Now, RPR is a certification, so there's not a lot of video out there that is official content of RPR. Now, I did find this video from Cal Dietz that talks about the um, wake-up drill, and I'm going to go ahead and use this for our example. But if you want the official RPR videos, I believe you have to take the course um, but even then, you can't get the videos. Um, but we do have three videos at RPR licensed to Team Builder, again, if you start a free trial. So in this case, I have this video, and I'm going to go ahead and go back to Team Builder and decide who to program for. So if I'm programming for a team and I want to incorporate RPR, I just have to choose which team to, to program for. I can choose baseball, and you can do this for clients or individuals as well. Um, but on the 17th, there's no workout yet, but let's say I wanted to start with a warm-up. And I wanted RPR to be the first thing that they did. So what I can do is, is I can go to warm up and I can type in RPR. And here are our RPR um, uh, like saved workouts that have videos. But if I'm creating a new one, um, I might just pretend like I have uh, a new extra, a new warm up called RPR and I can just say follow the video. OK, so um, I'm going to go ahead and add a video. And what I do is, is I just copy this YouTube video. So that being said, if you want to make your own videos, nothing prevents you from starting a YouTube channel and filming yourself doing some RPR or other things and then uploading those to YouTube and using your own videos right here in Team Builder. So in this case, I'm going to use uh, Coach Dietz's video. So I go ahead and paste this in and then I can go ahead and test it to see if it works. Yep, it does. Follow the video. And then now I add this to the workout. So now the first thing they'll see is RPR is the first thing that proceeds to the entire session. And I can come in here and then I can follow it up and say, you know, now time to do a dynamic warm up, which again, you can build in Team Builder. And then now you start building your training session for that day. Um, so, you know, this is pretty easy. And then from the athlete side of things, they typically use the iOS or mobile app uh, on iPhone to access these videos. And if I take an athlete like Mel Clark, who's on the baseball team, obviously he will have RPR for that day. So if it says RPR, follow the video, they can just click the video in their mobile app and the video will play for them right then and there. And then they can just keep continuing with their workout for the day. So that is a small snippet into how to use RPR in the team builder setting. Um, and like I mentioned, the videos, um, they're hard to find, uh, you know, videos that originate from RPR, but we do have three videos uh, that come with any team builder account that can be loaded in there upon request.